guys, it's Cupcake here. Look what MGA Entertainment was nice enough to send us. We've got the new Poopsie Unicorn Crush, where we can make sparkles fly. Look how pretty and glittery it is, but inside is an entire secret unicorn horn. We get to crush, glitter surprise, and then we mix the glitter and the slime. So what we're gonna need is two bowls, and I, oh, and I've got them. Try not to break them. So we're gonna keep one dry, and one's gonna be for our slime mixing. We're gonna need some room temperature water, and we've got that right here. So let's get our stuff out of the package. New slime from Poopsie Slime Surprise. I'm all for it. So what we're gonna do first is we've got pre-made slime. So we're gonna empty the pre-made slime into one of the bowls. Now this is gonna be scented already. Everything is made for us to go. Oh, look at the color, it's jelly slime. Okay, let's get into the packet just a little bit better. Oh, and we get so much of it, guys, look at that. This is such pretty slime, and I love that it's not sticky. Everything is ready to go for you in case you were ever having trouble making the slime yourself. Look how pretty it is. It's like clear slime with a tint of red, but after the two weeks without the bubbles, because you know with clear slime, you have to wait like two weeks to get all the air bubbles out and to get it clear like this, but with this, it's good to go. And the scent, let's smell it. Oh, I smell flowers. It smells like that perfume scent that comes with the poopsie slimes. So here is our slime in our slime bowl. Next step is checking the mighty unicorn horn. This is the biggest unicorn horn I have ever seen. Look how glittery it is. See the secret color of our unicorn horn on the inside of this gold. And this gold capsule is going to be our storage container. Isn't that the cutest little storage container you've ever seen? Okay, here we go. We've got a hot pink unicorn horn. That is our secret sand color. Now we've got a little arrow right here. What is it telling us to do? I think we're supposed to take it off. There you go. Snip on in here. Now with our unicorn horn, here's where we use our water. Now it just has to be room temperature water. It doesn't have to be hot or cold. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna loosely hold this in the water for about 10 seconds. Oh, I already feel the sand coming off of whatever's on the inside. You don't even need 10 seconds. It wasn't supposed to explode just yet. We're gonna have to take this and mix it into our slime. So what was supposed to happen was the unicorn horn was not supposed to melt. We were supposed to be able to crush it into the slime. Okay, so let's get whatever we can from in there and get it into our slime. So the instructions say that we're supposed to dunk it in the large bowl filled with water and loosely hold it for 10 seconds. So it was supposed to not melt like that, but it totally Totally melted when we did that. So we're gonna do our own method on the next one. Now here is what we're left with once I dunked out as much of the water as I could. We've got a lot of sand and glitter that they include in the unicorn horn. So let's get that in our slime. Hopefully that little bit of water did not ruin it. Mix, mix, mix. So we've got a bit of crunch and glitter in our slime with these new unicorn crushes. That is cool. So here's what we end up with. And it does make your slime a whole lot more when you add the extra ingredients in there. It's smushy, it's stretchy, it's like the perfect slime consistency. And when we're done playing with our slime, we can store it back in our unicorn container. I'm gonna try to fit all of it in there. If we can't, we'll just take some out. But actually, there's room on this side too. We may be able to include all of our slime. Yep, it closed all the way and it included all of our slime in there. So that is a pretty good size unicorn horn container. Okay, so we've got some clean water, a clean bowl for our next slime. Okay, we've got like an orangey color. Oh, look at that. I'm such a huge fan of jelly slime. I just think it's so cool that it's see-through with a tint of color and you could see like all the different little things you put in your slime. It smells orangey, but with a little bit of flower, like orange blossom scent. Now everything's a secret. There's no collector's guide or anything to tell you which scent you've got. So you just kind of 
gotta guess it yourself. I wonder which color our unicorn horn is. Okay, you guys ready? Is it gonna be orange? No, it's like a watermelon pink color. Or maybe red, you can say red. Not gonna follow those instructions that say dunk it into the water because you guys know what happened. It melted our unicorn horn. Don't wanna melt it. We wanna crush it over our slime. Okay, hopefully we don't mess this one up. Okay, I'm gonna dunk it in a little bit, a little bit to that side. I think it should be good. This is pretty soft sand. You don't need to dunk it all the way in. We're supposed to crush it. Oh, we did it! The way it was supposed to be done. So that is how you do it, folks. Look at our pink glitter. Okay, so this is gonna be really cool looking with our orange slime. We just mix it on in. It looks like lava slime. And you can add little spritz of water if you want your slime to be more stretchier. You can definitely do that. You can reach the slime consistency you want with the bit of water that you add. If you like the thicker slime, then you just leave it. So this one we've got in our unicorn case, but it actually expanded to way more than our case can hold. But look at that. Whoa, well, that is some amazing slime. Let's see on our next slime we've got. Oh, light pink slime. This is so pretty. It's a baby ah. pink slime. Make sure we get all of the slime out. So here is our baby pink slime. Let's smell it. Oh, I get a very perfumey scent from this one too. So all of these are more of perfume scented so far instead of fruity scented. Now, what color is a unicorn horn? We've got an orange unicorn horn. This would have gone perfect with our orange slime. So I'm just gonna dunk it in little by little. The sand is so soft right now, it feels like Play-Doh in my hands. Oh, it's about to break again, but I'm not gonna let it. There you go. Ooh, look at that, we're gonna crush it over our slime. We've got pink glitter. Now let's mix this all in, and here it is. What does this slime remind you of? I would say orange creamsicle. This next one is, is it a different color? No, it's that same pink color. It's a light baby pink, so let's smell it. Okay, this also smells like a perfume, and our unicorn horn is, <gasps> Baby pink! Okay, so this is gonna be a very pretty combination. Dunk it in just a wee bit. Bam. Oh, crunch it over the slime. That is the prettiest glitter for this color slime. Okay, so I have a feeling that I might have a favorite slime just now. So pretty. Okay, this one is definitely my favorite. There goes that stretchy stretchy. Our last two unicorn crunches. Which slimes will we get on these ones? Are we gonna get some blue slime? Something different? We did get something different. We've got lemony, lemon yellow slime. It really does remind me of lemonade. I wonder if it's lemon scented. Ooh, nice snap, crackle, and pop. Ooh, this one smells different. I smell like a root beer soda pop. Kinda has a vanilla scent to it. Let me smell it again. Yeah, this one's very softly scented. Definitely no perfume scent. And let's check out the unicorn horn color. That is going to change the color of our slime. What do we have? We have orange. Okay, that's a good color combo, but I do think it's gonna change our slime into an entirely orange slime again. And we're just gonna dip, dip, dip. Crunch, oh, look at that gold glitter. Let's crunch and smush everything together. We still have a tint of orange to it, but the glitter does make it different from our orange slime. What do you guys think the color is gonna be in this one? Maybe we've got a blue. Did I just see green? I think I did, we got a green slime, like an apple green. Oh, and I think I do smell apple. Is this our first fruity scented one? Yes, I love fruity scented ones. Okay, let me smell it from up close. It is, I smell apple cinnamon. It smells like apple pie. Whoa, that is a first for Poopsie. We've got apple scented, but we don't have apple cinnamon. And our unicorn horn is, well, bam! Whoa, it's a green one. Surprise, surprise. I love the matchy matchy colors, but what is the glitter color? All righty, my pretty. Let me dunk you in the water. Dunk, 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 all the corners. Okay, guys, we are ready to crunch. It's got green glitter, woo! Ooh, it's a matchy matchy shamrock slime. I would call this leprechaun slime. What would you guys name it? Mix it in, mix it in. That is a very pretty slime. 
little bit more water. Nice and stretchy. I love these unicorn crunches. You just never fail with them. All the slimes come out amazing. Now these are so, so cute with the unicorn horn containers. They're definitely a win in my book. Scented glittery slime that we can customize to our own little heart's delight. Okay, you guys are thinking it and my telepathy skills are telling me you guys want slime mixing. So we're gonna mix those slimes. We've got our purple slime. Here's a wee bit more of the purple. Our shamrock slime. Here's our yellow golden slime. Orange slime. And let's see, we've got slime in these containers. Here is our red slime. Ooh, nice. Right on in there. Take it all out. Let's just go to town. Some more red slime. We've got a little bit more in here. I think this was our first slime. Yep, this was the first slime. Ooh, this is actually smelling really nice right now. We've got a whole bunch of smells going on, guys. And I think we've got all, no, we don't have all the slimes. We've got a little bit more of our orange slime. Stretch it on in there. That's looking pretty cool. It's looking like a neon slime concoction. And I think we've got all the slimes from our horns. So we've got an unboxing and a slime mixing all in one video. Let's mix this all up, see what we end up with. I would say it's more of an orange slime with a whole bunch of glitter in all these different colors. It is a pretty color though. All right, I think we've done enough damage for now. What do you guys think of our Poopsie Unicorn Crunches? An A plus in my book, even though school is on break right now, I'm still giving this an A plus. I'm grading it. Let me know in the comment section what your favorite slime was. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye for now.